So I got this, uh, well, half of a five-horse bridge from the scrapyard today. Uh, looks pretty good from the outside. You know, I got the oil dipstick and that, but no carburetor or nothing. And uh, I, I took it apart already. But uh, when I flipped it over, normally I mark my uh, <coughs> um, identification number on the bottom. And I noticed something was a little funky with the crankcase cover there, so I got looking and see you get water dripping out of there. So it looks like it's it's cracked. So I thought oh, I'll probably uh, blew the connecting rod, but that wasn't in fact. So then I took the cylinder head off, and that wasn't what was wrong with it because the piston moved just fine. So. I happened to be talking to my son, told him about the bottom being humped out like that. And as you can see, it's cracked all the way. He says, well, maybe it froze up. And I think he was right, because if you see the camshaft, it's all rusty. More rust on the back there. So I think she was right full of water, and it froze up and broke. It even, if you look down the crankcase cover, it's even bowed downwards. So, I think we got a freeze victim here. So, um, wouldn't be good for much more than a Frankenbriggs engine at this point. I wouldn't really trust that broken crankcase unless a person aluminum welded it up or something. But, uh, I think that's the first uh, five horse I've seen that's froze up like that. So, we solved that mystery of why the crankcase was bulged. Normally when they blow up, they, they take this side out over here, opposite the camshaft. Sometimes they break the camshaft in half, other things, but say they're getting kind of rare these days, so I generally pick them up when I see them. So, been uh, taking a little bit of a summer vacation lately. Uh, some poppy plants growing here. They grow all over the place. And, and uh, then we got our uh, lily trees here. They're making quite the quite the smell. They're a little past their their due date here. A big uh, some roses here. Um, we had a, a big thunderstorm came down. It kind of beat up on them there a couple days back. So luckily it didn't take out our tomato trees here. They're well, they're at least six feet tall now. Big mound of cucumbers. I think we're up to 30 cucumbers so far. But yeah, just uh, taking it easy. It's been fairly hot. It's pushing 90 Fahrenheit today here. So, sitting in the shade, tearing down the Briggs. So, everybody have a good one. Enjoy the summer while it lasts.